Methyl-directed mismatch repair, or MMR, ensures that DNA replication maintains a high level of fidelity. MMR decreases the level of inherited misincorporation of nucleotides by approximately 10 to 100 fold. Misincorporation occurs when DNA polymerase incorrectly base pairs two nucleotides. This can occur due to the presence of base analogs. However, DNA replication is semi-conservative and the cell can differentiate the parent strand and the new mutated strand. This is done by observing the methylation state of the strands of DNA. Newly synthesized DNA will not yet be methylated while the parent strand will be methylated. We say this DNA is hemimethylated. Mute S binds to the duplex DNA that contains mispaired bases and small insertion or deletions. It binds to ATP and ADP and interacts with mute L. When mute L is bound to ATP, it will interact with mute H, causing a DNA loop to form. Mute L increases mute H's nicking activity. Mute H is a single strand endonuclease that binds to the GATC sequence. Mute H nicks the unmethylated DNA strand at the GATC sequence. This nicking will only occur if Mute H is stimulated by Mute L. Exonucleases, XOI or XOX, degrade the DNA past the mismatch with the help from a helicase. This allows DNA polymerase 3 to resynthesize the DNA strand and correct the error. DNA ligase fills in the gap. Dam methylase methylates the newly synthesized strand.